Oh, from Dumbarton. But I'm not here to see Dumbarton play, I'm here to see Broomhill versus Civil Service Trollers in the Lowland League. As I say, there's something inside the cobbles bones, like elephant dust and volcanic stone. There you go, it's a stone near Dumbarton FC. I think it's a fine location. The sun's going to cause problems here, I think. But uh, there you go. Look at that. I love the location there beside the Dumbarton Rock there. Uh, the Rock Engine Kingdom is Strathclyde. There you go, it's a lovely setting. Uh, yeah, I'm here with Ross, he's a Dumbarton fan. How are you doing, Ross? I'm alright. So you say you know the couple of Dumbarton games, but you thought you'd come to Broom Hill tonight to, yeah, to watch them? I'm not into Broom, so I thought I'd just bounce up and watch Broom Hill. Really Have you seen Broom Hill before then? No? No. no? I've never seen them. I've all and we've gone for say, but how how are the bottom doing then? They've been pretty well. Uh, eh? I think we're actually second in the league in goal difference. I think Bonnery Groves are first. Aye. But I'm not sure. Aye, it's a, it's a tough league because uh, Bonnery Groves have started well, haven't they? Aye, they started well. They may all get relegated last season, Aye, but they're doing well so far this they were, season. They were down the bottom, in fact, that bottom of that league was really interesting last season. I think it'll be the same again. The game. I think it was, yeah, it was Rovers that went down, because you went to that game, you went to the Rovers Spartans. Okay, yeah. well, I hope you enjoy the game and we'll go speak to you later. Well, it's amazing the random things you see around the line of the football grounds. There's a, there's a chair there, a wee bit. <laughs> Better, <laughs> worse for wear, as they say. And, you know, there's a couple of, couple of wheels here. I don't know where they've come off, it's some buggy or something. And there's quite a few bikes here. I don't know if the grounds been. We're all bikers, well, we're not drivers, so there must be some program on or something. Just waiting for kickoff at uh, Strollers in the All Red. That's our other strip. They either play All Red or All Blue. And Broom Hill are in the, the blue and white. And yes, kickoff. Chance here. Oh, 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 A free kick to the Solas here. Oh, no. There we go. Come on, here. You ball him. Oh. There we go. Oh. Well, it's the first real chance for the Solas. Oh, 
Yeah. Well done, Fiona. Oh, Alright. Oh, oh. You can take that away. Oh, bro. Well. Yeah, the free kick you see the box for. Oh, it's a head on the goal. Uh, Bruno. Uh, yes. 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 Give a dig! Yeah! Yes! There we go, what else, folks? They get promoted into the lower league. Oh, we're going to choose, if that makes sense. Because. Oh, good chance here. Oh. Well, that's the first corner of the game, I think, is the first corner. Oh, I feel that one. Oh, we're going on our car. Oh, I'm okay. That's the second corner of the broom hole. Well, there's a penalty to Broomhill there, just looking back at it. Okay, Broomhill, are you taking the score as well? Goal score for Broomhill, number seven, Paul Kennedy! Did he score the goal? another chance. Oh, you tackled. That's half time. That's uh, 2 1 to Broom Hall there. The real ladies are very happy. <laughs> so, Ross, what do you think of the first half then? First, it was a bit scrappy, wasn't it? It was a very scrappy, then also Broom Hall get the first goal. Who was it? I think it was Kennedy. Yeah. Probably. And then, not long after, maybe 10 minutes after, you scored who won. But it was a mistake, eh? Yeah. It, it was a horrible. The, the defender passed it back to him when he scored. And then, Broom held it a penalty, but was it a penalty, really? Yeah, I know. It was a bit dodgy. Back, it's, it's, it's difficult to tell. There's too, too many players in the way. But you're right, it was a scrappy start of the game. You go by Broom Hall as well. You can go anywhere, eh? I mean, What's your prediction? Do you think it will be the same? Each. Three. 
Switch, like I, I, I could be, could well be. Okay, thanks for the seeing you. Ah, there's kick off. Oh no, it's no. One of these, one of these false alarms. Here we go. Kick off. Oh. There's something in there, that's it. Good save there. Well done, he's got it. Really? There's a free kick in a dangerous position here. Oh, there's a oh. Somebody went up to earlier there. I'm lucky. Oh, there's a chance here. Oh. No. The dig here, oh! No, I don't get that. First corner uh, the half to Blue Hall. You won't get the ball, eh? There's two others, can they get a goal? Oh, it's a lot! Oh. He's on a uh, good ball. Ah. Uh, Oh, 
Well, that was really nothing now. I was a high ball there before, I think, but... There we go! Oh. Oh. Yes! Hey. There we go! That's... Oh, two. Hey. Oh, that's, that's full time right away. There you go, 4 2. Need the uh, score a bit respectable. So I heard about an initiative that you were doing today with the gate money, could you explain that? Uh, yeah, well we've been doing an initiative with schools to get um, more kids in, so we've been giving free tickets and whatnot. Um, and we've also um, had for this match, it was entry by donation, uh, so it was pay what you can at the gate. Um, with all the donations going to the Western Bartonshire uh, Community Food Share. Right. So it's been great and everybody that came along tonight has been really supportive and we've raised over £300. Oh, that's so very good. Can't knock it. No, that's very good. Thanks very much. Thanks very much. Well, thanks for watching. Many people are predicting, probably mischievously, the demise of Broomhill Football Club after their sponsorship deal with Open Goal ended. That included uh, their management team as well moving to East O'Brien. Uh, but no, they're there, uh, and it's quite clear that they want to establish themselves in the Dumbarton, the foreseeable future. That was a great initiative, by the way. Uh, pay what you can or for what you can afford uh, at the, for, for the game entry today, and all the money raised went to a local future initiative. So well done to Broomhill for that. It was great meeting Ross. Uh, he'd messaged me to say he was coming to the game. Dumbarton fan, he, very knowledgeable, he'd recognised a uh, former Stennis Muir player is now playing for the, the Strollers because Dumbarton and Stennis Muir are in the same league. He's asking a lot of interesting questions as well. Good meeting you Ross and I'll hopefully see you again in another game. A great game for the neutral eh? Six goals, two penalties, a penalty miss, save, whatever you want. Uh, and there was even a sending off, it wasn't a player by the way. <laughs> but you know, I, the game I did win for the neutral. I was disappointed from a Strollers point of view it didn't help that two of my favourite players were out injured. Conrad Balatoni and Mark Laird weren't playing. And I think that made a big difference as well. We had uh, an opportunity to go 3-2. Uh, Ennis Lawson, a great player, scored some great goals. Oh, it was uh, really uh, disappointing. It was not long after that, Broomall went up there to make it 4-1. Uh, so at least the Stolers got a goal back uh, at the death. Uh, to make the score line a bit more respectable, 4-2. And just like uh, Ross did, if you know I'm going to a game, give me a shout. Uh, speak to me, don't want need to appear on camera, but I'm really interested in speaking to people about the games you go to, about football in general. So if you see me, give me a shout. No, please like and share. And the best thing you can do, if you like what I do, is subscribe to my channel. So thanks again for watching, and I'll see you behind the goals.